So welcome back to Triple Eats. In this week's video, we're going to be trying the brand new pizza box from Greg's. As you can see here, you get six slices of pizza. How much did it cost? $7.99, this deal's running. $7.99 for six slices of pizza, which is pretty good to be fair. We're also trying the garlic and herb dip. Uh, this costs an extra 40p if you want to get it. Yeah, so this whole thing was about £9.19. $7.99 with the deal and 40p a pot of sauce. We got, we got three sauces. And it smells delicious. <laughs> you reckon it'll be better than Domino's? That's what we got to judge it on. Smell it. It smells exactly the same. Yeah, it low-key does. To be fair, it does smell like Domino's garlic and herb. So we got cheese and pepperoni pizza, but there's supposed to be a third one. They didn't have it in stock. What was it? Chicken. Chicken pizza. But yeah, we just got the two pizzas to try here. Which pizza is everyone going to try? I've never had Greg's pizza before. Greg's pizza looks like old school school dinner pizza. Lunchtime. Yeah, lunchtime dinner. Kind of floppy. That's the word I was looking for. It's going to break. Whenever I go Greg's, I always get the pepperoni one. I've never had the margarita. Yeah. Mm. It's probably just the same anyway. It's just the pepperoni. With that. <laughs> I like it. It is a good pizza to be fair. It's just like your standard, like, yeah. I don't know how to describe it, like standard cheap pizza, but it is good. Definitely what I was saying, school pizza. Yeah, you're right, it is like that. Very nice pizza, Greg's. I do like that. It's like you get a tomato-y, would you say basil? Basil. Like it's a herby tomato flavor, isn't it? Yeah, it's not bland at all. No, it's not just plain tomato. It bees like a herby, like herb type of taste. I don't know how to explain it. A good flavour. Yeah. Very oily. There is some sort of flavouring on it, but I don't know what it is. I want to give it a try with the sauce though. Let's try it with the dip. So we, they have three, they have three options of dips. What flavours is there? Ketchup, barbecue and garlic and herb, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So the three we different chose dips. garlic and herb. Let's see if it's as good as Domino's. It is a good garlic and herb sauce. It's similar, to be fair, to Domino's. It is very similar. It's probably more creamy, yeah. Yeah, it's like... You don't get much of a flavour from it. Yeah, it's more like a mayo. Yeah. More like a mayo. I think I prefer Domino's for the flavour of garlic and herb, but it's not bad. I feel like it's similar to the Asda's one. Low-key, yeah, like a supermarket brand. Yeah. But it's not bad. No. Could have done with a bit more garlic coming through. I think, yeah. Mm -hmm. It is good though. It does, does need more garlic. So what are we rating that? The pepperoni pizza I'd give out of 10. A solid 6.5 out of 10. How about you? I'll give it an 8. Yeah. <laughs> I always like it. I'm giving it a bit of a lower end score. 6. And then the garlic and herb dip, I'll probably give... Uh, yeah. Probably give it a 6 out of 10 as well. It's not out of this world, is it? Yeah, I'd give that like a 5.5. .5. I'm going to give it a 5. Yeah. Look at the grease. I think we should try the margarita next, yeah? Yep. Oh. Margarita next. Margarita. Surely it's going to taste the same. As the... <laughs> we needed the chicken one, but they didn't have that. We wanted to do the katsube, but they didn't have that either. They only had two. We needed three. So let us know if you want us to try the katsube. We'll have to be back, but it's the pizza for now. Margarita next. Let's try it. I think I prefer the plain margarita. This is more tomato-y. Mm -hmm. I like the margarita on its own. Way more sweeter. Like the um, pepperoni, obviously because of the meat on there, was saltier, but uh, yeah, I don't know. Why is the tomato sauce on that seem different? It's like, there it, it is, it's they sweet. Have used, so you've used a different sauce on this. This is actually tomato-y, whereas the other one was a herby taste. Yeah. I prefer that one. I like that. The plain margarita is very nice. It's like them um, plain circle, you know, the little mini ones, the mini pizzas you can get. That's good, that. The one pound cheese pizzas from yeah. Asda. <laughs> I thought the pepperoni would have been better. 
Have you ever tried the margaritas on its own? No, no. that was my first time. It's probably your new go-to. Should we try it with the dip? I think you get more of the taste of the garlic with this, with this pizza. Do you not think? I didn't try it. <laughs> <laughs> I agree, you do. It does taste more garlicky with Let the plain try. cheese. It Let me try it. Oh, yeah. I think the pepperoni was overpowering it. Yeah, I agree. You do get more of a garlic flavour just with the plain margarita. It must be because it's like sweeter. Yeah. So what are you rating that? The margarita is getting a higher score. Definitely like a 7.5. Maybe like an 8 out of 10. I don't want to say 8 out of 10 because the actual pizza itself. It's like a cheap pizza. Yeah, it's not like, you know what I mean, a proper pizza. But I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10. It's nice. I'm giving it a 6.5. Well, what did I give the pepperoni? Because I... I'm going to give this an 8.5 then. Yeah, that's way higher than your pepperoni. You give it like a 6 or a 6.5. Did I give 6? Oh, yeah, something like that. Oh, I'll give it an 8 then. Yeah. Because I thought I gave it 8. <laughs> so if we was to buy them again, I think I'd only get the plain cheese pizza. I agree. Yeah. Probably would just get the margarita next time as well. If... Way more flavour. Yeah, but they never have it. <laughs> it was just a one-off chance they had that today. Do they actually not usually have the plain cheese? Whenever I go in, it's always pepperoni. That's rare. I rarely go in. Thanks for watching. Make sure to comment down below if you've ever tried the Greg's pizzas. Or if you're going to get the box yourself. See you next week.